Okay, what is up mga repa? So, it's been a long time since nag-upload ako ng kahit na anong video. And today we're just going out, you know, testing out a few things. You might notice something different if you've been watching my other videos. Uh, yeah, that's uh, actually the sound of um, my exhaust. Kasi nagkabit tayo ng ano, ng... SC project na exhaust. Well, it's not legit SC project, of course, you know. It's just something I found off of FB Marketplace. May silencer din ako nito. Anyway, later on, uh, you know, we're gonna test it out. Static test. For, uh, you know, the decibel rating. So this is what a uh, a fairly loud exhaust pipe sounds like. Yep, it does sound fairly loud. As in literal ego, nanda. We're just gonna, you know, test it out, make sure everything's nice and tight. Kasi nagpalit din ako ng mga fairings ko. So uh, left and right, you know, outer panels. No more big ass scratches. All right, here we go. So it's not terribly loud. Not exactly to my liking either, because parang medyo matapang pa yung tunog niya. Not quite the bassy, buo na tunog that I would prefer, but it's kind of getting there. So just for the purpose of this test drive, ano, hindi ako naka hindi ko ginagamit yung Bluetooth headset ko dito kasi usually I listen to music, I, you know, I keep it turned on, you know, just in case na may tumawag sa akin or, you know, just to fight off the boredom. Eh nasasagot ko kagad yung tawag. But today we're not doing that. Pipe is pretty. La, parang hindi hindi ganito yung nai-imagine ko dati nung you know when I was just seeing these things on other motorcycles. Parang hindi ko nai-imagine na ganito siya. Well, I guess it's a different thing, you know, seeing one and then riding on it. Now we're gonna take it out through Edsa so we can kind of ring it and see what happens. Oh god, it's in it. I should have woken up earlier for this. Spotting a little backfire. Parang medyo. Feels kind of okay.
What is this? Alright, so uh, that just about ends the vlog here. I guess it's a uh, welcome back to me and we're still back at square one. Dahil GCQ pa rin Metro Manila a year later. <laughs> so tulad na lagi ko sinasabi sa mga repa na ride safe. Sige na sige, keep yourselves healthy out there. Mm, I think we're still in it for the long haul man. And I'll see you again on the next episode. Okay, so I'm just making an approximation here because uh, it says on the uh, you know LTO guidelines. Oh, it's nice. Nagba burn na yun tip niya. It's looking pretty. Um, did I tighten this last night? I uh, I don't think so. Anyway, uh, sabi sa LTO guidelines. Hey, check this out first. Nice, no? Wala na scratches. So according to the LTO guidelines, it has to be about half a meter away and then 45 degree angle uh, at the exhaust center line. So it's kind of a... Yeah, it's a little loud than what I'm used to, pero I downloaded a, uh, a free app on... Uh, from the Play Store. So we're gonna go and see. Sabi kasi sa kanya, the LTO regulations, 2,000 to 2,500 RPMs. So we're gonna try that out now and, uh, you know, see what happens. Alright, so, medyo maingay na to begin with yung uh, paligid natin, ano? But we're just gonna measure yung spike. Well, you know what? We're, uh, let's just not fiddle with it so much. So I guess, you know, yeah, I guess this would be 45 degrees. Hindi nga na siya center line exactly. We're gonna watch yun, ano. Let's go first. It says here, One minute, 37 seconds later. Yeah, we're still getting 89 decibels. How do we get 99 though? Ten seconds later. Well, I only got it up to 90, pero pigasha talaga. So, I'm gonna save that. Damn. Damned. That sounds nice actually sounds like a bigger displacement bike now damn dude 